We have live team coverage of the spread of COVID-19 in Bend, Missouri. ABC 17's Amber Tabling joins us live in Columbia after CPS paused their alternative learning classes this week to reevaluate its learning methods. Amber, the school district used the extra time to plan what alternative learning could soon look like for its students. Deborah Lucas, CPS spokeswoman Michelle Baumstark, said the school district had an internal meeting with teachers today to go over the potential plan of learning methods. Now, CPS has used the last three days for planning to see what curriculum fits the needs of the teachers and students best. Baumstark said that meeting, in that meeting, they discussed what the future of CPS education could look like and what curriculum coordinators are thinking moving forward. CPS is waiting to hear back from teachers with any feedback and questions that may arise from the potential plan they discussed today, as they do need a long-term plan. Baumstark says they plan to move forward in that planning process by telling parents and students on Monday after hearing that feedback from the teachers. We need a long-term plan um, as we consider um, an additional length of time that we're going to be closed and and away from in-person classes. Um, so we are using these days to get that work done. And as I mentioned, Bomb Stark said that nothing is final and that they are still working on those potential plans. And that will be finalized on Monday. Live in Columbia, Amber Tabling, ABC 17 News. ABC 17 News plans to speak with CPS Superintendent Peter Steepleman on our newscast at 6 o'clock Monday morning.